What is going on guys, Joe here, back with another video. Now, it's good to be back. I haven't posted a video in over a week, uh, but now I'm back with another video. Now, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I recently posted a picture on Instagram and it was just showing off my lock screen because I thought it was pretty dope looking and a lot of you guys seem to like it. So uh, I did get some feedback saying I should make a video on it. So here's a video on what's on my lock screen. Now you do see that I have these pretty dope looking uh, rising bars and there's a couple more things. I have a different battery indicator. Also I have my own JB Tech Cario logo. So first, of course, we have to be jailbroken, and then we'll head over to Cydia, and then download a tweak called Alkaline. Now, this will allow you to change the different battery indicator, and also along with Alkaline, you'll also have to download Live Battery Indicator iOS 7. Now, this will give you different little battery indicators. It'll combine both the battery icon and also the battery percentage into one, and we'll get into more detail here in a minute about that. Another tweak I have is called Subtle Lock for iOS 7 and this will basically give you a subtle lock screen kind of minimize things you can disable different things like that that will actually cost you a buck and we also need to download Zeppelin this will just simply allow you to change the carrier logo to different symbols icons things like that I have mine set to JB Tech 17 but I'll give you more details on that here in a little bit and next we will need to download a tweak called Sidget and this is gonna be free so download Sidget, and now after we download Sidget, lastly what we need to do is go into our sources by simply hitting manage, and then go to sources, then we'll hit edit, and then add, because we're gonna have to add a new source, and the source is gonna be linked right down below in the description and also here on screen. It's gonna be patrickmuff.ch forward slash repo, and once you add that, go ahead and click on the source, and we'll have to scroll down to where it says iOS 7 rising bars Sidget. So this is going to be the rising bars which you saw in the beginning of the video. It gives you a new way to tell time from your lock screen which looks pretty cool. But let's go ahead and change up the settings and make it look like mine. First we'll go into our settings application. Then we'll scroll down to alkaline. And then here on the theme we'll go ahead and select the one that says LBI circular B and W. 32 pixels. It's a medium size. Uh, battery icon with the battery percentage in the middle and this is just gonna be black and white You can choose the color one right down below now if we go back We'll go down to Sidget and on Sidget we'll go to lock Sidget order and then we'll select rising bars So go ahead and select that and then we'll just head back to Sidget up here And then I have now playing enabled uh, this will just force the away view um, Whenever you have music playing, but anyways now we'll go down to subtle lock and on subtle lock I have these options enabled right here. I have the hide slider, so that'll hide your slider, of course, obviously, right? <laughs> and then going down below, I have everything disabled, and also I'm gonna go ahead and disable clock transition. So with all of these being disabled, it gives it more of a cleaner look on your lock screen, like the control center grabber is gone, the notification center grabber up top is gone, the camera grabber is gone, all that stuff is gone. Now if we go back and we scroll down to Zeppelin, I do have the theme JB Tech 17, which is gonna be my little carrier logo or my JB Tech 17 logo. I actually made that myself. If you are interested in downloading that and installing it on your iDevice, go ahead and leave a like down below along with a comment saying that you want to rock a JB Tech 17 carrier logo on your iDevice. And there is one last thing that you need to do if you wanna change your rising bars into 12 hour mode because it, right now it is set to 24 hour mode so it'll display from zero all the way to 24 hours. But if you wanna tell time like AM and PM, then you'll need to download iFile. And that does cost some money. I believe you do get a free trial when you first download it. So I mean, that's all you really need it for if you wanna change up some code in there. But all you gotta do is download iFile, go ahead and open up iFile, make sure you go all the way back. And here we'll simply go down to system, we'll go to library, and then we'll scroll down to where it says lock sidgets. Click on that and then we'll go ahead and find risingbars.sidget. Open up that folder. And then we'll need to open up the very last file which is going to be risingbars.js. And then go ahead and open it up in text viewer. And once in text viewer you'll get the code and then we'll need to change the make it 12 hour line which is going to be the fourth line. It's going to be on false. So we need to change that to true if you want to do 12 hour clock time. And once you change it to true, we'll save it, we'll hit done. And now you can lock your device and then you'll see that you have 
the 12 hour time. So that is actually it guys. That's how you get a pretty dope looking lock screen in my opinion. Anyways, if you did like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Not only helps me, but it supports the channel as well. And if you're not following me on any of my social networks like Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, or Google Plus, all the links will be down below. So be sure to do that and uh, go ahead and subscribe so you won't miss any future videos. But like I did mention earlier, if you would like me to make a video on how to get a JB Tech carry logo like this, go ahead and leave a like and also a comment down below that you want to see that. But other than that, guys, appreciate you guys for watching and uh, I'll catch you all in the next one. All right? Peace.